Okay, if you've got Windows 8, you might be feeling the same frustrations I do, especially if you googled how to change it back to get your start menu. Um, I do not understand what Windows has done. Uh, sorry, Microsoft has done with Windows, where it's got the apps, which an app, the app menu to me is like computers for idiots, but um, it doesn't. I, do stuff you really want to be doing. You know, if you want to do Microsoft Word, Office or stuff, it's desktop stuff. It's not something that needs a separate little app. And to think for years we're trying to clear our desktop from all those little icons and now they're back again. Anyway, to get a Windows 7 familiar uh, start menu that actually does stuff, um, all you want to do is install this classic shell. Um, I'll put this link this one here. I'll put the link for you in the uh, bottom of bottom of the the YouTube video. But basically, what you want to do once you install it, you'll get the if you right click, you'll get this little menu, and you go to settings, and you can decide how you want it. Do you want it classic with two columns, Windows Seven style, classic style? I'm gonna go Windows Seven style on mine. Uh, keep start menu. I mean you can change it and it just changes this little icon here, but I'm not really interested in that uh, What have I got? Yeah So okay, so we we've decided that we're Gonna put it to whoa, whoa. I've lost the menu I was on hang on Menu look language Main menu that's it. Sorry. Back to the start button. So you can see there's a fair bit of functionality in there you can alter to suit. But I just want this basic Windows 7 so I can actually see the programs I want to run. So I just click OK. And if you left click now, they're all here. Common Sense has been reintroduced to your Windows. Um, so it's as simple as that. Just download this. It's free. Uh, they got different languages in there for the installer as well, so that'll be quite useful to some guys. Alright, thanks for watching.